Hey guys, girls, or things. Today I'm here with Into the Breach. This was a game I actually decided to look at recently and I um, ended up getting because one of my friends recommended it to me. I've played a little bit so far. I've played the um, tutorial. I've played the opening game so I know a little bit about how the game works. But for, uh, <clears throat> for you guys and for the sake of uh, starting the video off in a good place, I will start a new game. So far, just to show you, I'm this far, only three things in, and that's about a, uh, I don't know how far that would be, actually, maybe in 45 minutes of progress. I just closed the game, because I am a fool. Wrong app. I am actually just a fool. Oh, gosh. I didn't want to say quit. I thought it meant quit to the main menu. Mm. I am very intelligent, aren't I? But while you're here, might as well just check out these and see if there's anything you guys want to see. Any suggestions, I'll take them. Yeah. Ah, oh, that hurt. That hurt to restart that, I'm not going to lie. Let's see. I'll play through this, or try to play through it normally to begin with. If you guys want to see, like, a hard playthrough, you won't. I'm joking. I, I'll... If I feel like playing a hard playthrough, I will. But it probably won't be good content. It will probably be me screaming in the corner of my room, and then we won't get anywhere. So I'm gonna... Right now, I'm gonna stick to normal. You can call me a loser. Call me weak. It's fine. But... I played three things in this game so far on the first island, and I had a few struggles, to say the least. So, I'm just going to stick to normal for now. And of course, as always, I'm here to whoop some can of beans on your face. So with that said, we can now begin. We'll hold this timeline, no matter what. Well, I just erased the last one, so I hope so. Oh, cool, it's an RNG spawn. I did not know that. If you are from the future, you'll find our island even further back in time than you expected. If not for the VEC, I'd love to have give you a tour of the old Earth relics. Oh, so last time it spawned me over here, actually. Now it's spawning me over... That's pretty interesting. Although I think it keeps the same as in like the distance because when I spawned over here, two of these things, I'm pretty, no, no, I think it was different. Never mind. I thought two of these things were the same over here, but I think that's different. So, according to all my logic so far, I feel like going this one is the best. I was overseeing maintenance on old earth locomotive myself. Good thing to when Vec struck old horse became the backbone of our supplies. Oh shoot, it just skips the tutorial now. I just restarted. I could have just play, replayed the tutorial. I feel like a fool. Can I still quit out of this? Okay, in-game tutorial. Lovely. I just set my back, myself back for no reason. It's fine. Okay, so... Let's just start this in all honesty. Yeah. Okay, so. It's kind of like your standard, not an RTS, but a strategy game. If you've ever played Fire Emblem, it kind of reminds me of that. So, like, I'm just gonna, I deploy my units. There's no particular reason. I put them, I could put them here. I could put them on any of these. White, yellow, whatever color that happens to be spaces. These ones I'm, like, mousing over. And I will throw them down. My main job is to protect that. My main goal is to protect this stuff. My main goal is like to protect these, but since I have a special objective that will give me these two stars, I also need to protect this train. I also have to beat this in three turns, which is always fun. This guy is going to be there by the next turn. Um, what I'm going to do, I'm going to move here. 
fire upon you like this. I should have checked which way he was like gonna go. Okay, this guy's going to attack down here. Uh, he'll surface after that, so there's no reason really not just to punch this man. Also, yeah, he has a long range attack, a shot that does not back. He has like a smaller thing. Oh gosh, I'm bad at this game. I just realized my mistake. Why am I bad at the game? Okay, so he's webbed and he can't move. I apologize for that. I'm gonna blame it on that I'm still like waking up. Oh shoot, that was a long range. Fudge me. This is not looking good actually. I need to like stop my actions. This just went incredibly poorly. Oh, he's already dead. I have not lost unit so far in this game, but Lovely. So now... Mm. Okay, I know what I'm gonna do. Okay, so first I'm going to have to fire on this man. He's also on fire, does extra damage. Thought that would kill him. Okay, I'm illiterate. Lovely. Mm. Uh, how much damage does this do? Oh, this is dead. Fudge. Okay. If I reset my turn, will it throw me back to the last turn? No, it will not do anything. Lovely. So, this is a great start to our playthrough. I was so good at this game yesterday when it was 3 o'clock at night. I only think well at night. Uh, we might have to already start a new... Oh no, that was calculated, see? Lovely. First time I've had a building destroy in any of my playthroughs. Kind of bad. What's all this death from? Okay, how much health does this train? One health! I'm pretty sure I cannot physically stop this. Wait, I might be able to pull something off. Never mind, that killed him. Yeah, no, the train's gone. This was a massive failure on my part. I might just abandon this timeline and call this a tutorial, honestly. Yeah, I'm restarting that. No way, no how. Uh, that was such a crappy first mission that I kind of want to restart it, honestly. I can't redo it. Uh, I want to restart it, but for the sake of actual gameplay, I don't think I should. Let's just pretend that never happened. Protect the old earth bar. Oh, this bar. Okay, I was like, what is that? Do I get movement first? I do. No, they get movement first. I did not know that. 
Or just I forgot that. Do these create fire? Old Earth Mind, any unit that stops in the space will trigger in my. That's convenient. Lovely. I can't really do too much then, actually. Uh, he can get there. Yeah, you're gonna move here. I'm an illiterate fool who can't read. Lovely, I can't hit any of them. These mines are actually the worst. Where can you move? Nowhere good. Nowhere good at all. Wow. Can you, like, if I moved him, would you be able to move here and do nothing for me? I should have read the hazards before I threw these guys down in any real situation. I don't know how to get rid of that. I might. This step playthrough is gonna go very poorly if this is how it starts out. Gosh. How to play this? I'm just gonna have to punch him, honestly, probably. Let's pack a space. Will knockback still apply, or will he be killed first? That's a good question. Might as well test that, honestly. gonna die though whatever worth the hit I think that was dumb I just like threw a carcass at someone uh, how much health does he have three knockback is the best option honestly I meant no undo that move I need to go further dilemma. How should I handle this? Mm. He's probably gonna end up having to punch him, honestly. Yeah, he's gonna end up having to punch him. Which, I need to move. How? This move, man's blocked. 
I'm gonna end up pushing him here. That might kill him, honestly. Let me think. Yeah, that will kill him. Okay, that's good. So if I kill him, then I can use my orbital launch. Okay. I have a plan. So I'm going to shoot him here. Knock him here. Make him attack nothing. Then... I'm going to 360 no scope this man right here. And then... Fire this right here. Oh shoot, that's ranged. Okay, I did not know that was ranged all the way through. That offers more of a problem. So, I don't want to take power grid damage is the thing. These guys attack in a straight line. Okay, I think I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to push him here. He's going to attack him here. Yes, and then I'll be able to move him out here. Push him over over one. So, actually no, I need to shoot him first, honestly, right? Then I'll push him here, let him attack him. Let him just take a hit. Because after this, I only need one turn. I doubt I'll take that much damage in that one turn. So, hopefully, I did my math right. Oh, this is easy now. Okay. Um... Yeah, no, this guy will have to take care of him anyway, I see, so I might as well do this first. Now, I'll deal with this without taking any. I have two points of damage left. Okay, I see what I'm going to do. I'm going to shoot him into there. That will kill him, so. That will kill him. So I'll have three, and then I can just move this man around here and punch. So the guys only attack one space, yeah.
Wait, shoot, I have one more turn. No, okay, there we go, there we go. There we go, two stars left. That means I can purchase things once the silent is open. One mech reactor, pilot mech reactor, in case I want. What does that, it's, what does that entail? What does that entail, I wonder? Hold on. Let's see. It's one mech reactor. Pilot gains one mech reactor. And I can't do anything with that. Oh. You can use reactor power to improve your weapons or power addition weapons. It's all reactor cords to upgrade. So he got... Oh, cool. Tech fist dash. So. Can I upgrade any of that? Charge any distance before touching the target. Oh, I only have one power. Oh, okay. I went with that. Okay, there we go. Um, so. Let's go for another one. Uh, I want more power, honestly. Protect the emergency batteries. Yeah, why not spring for that? Oh, that's not hard. So... That seems pretty well spread out. What is this? Bombs will drop here, instantly killing any... Oh, that's cool. So I'm gonna shoot him. Got it. Then I'm probably going to end up... Trying to knock back him. I could just hit him directly. Okay, I can still move in. gonna have to take a hit buddy okay first let me resolve up here first okay so I could just shoot him no what I could do is I cannot sidestep him I can't punch him into a building gosh what to do, what to do. I could move him here. Make him punch, shoot him. And if you shoot him...
there'll be it'll kill him yeah if you shoot him it'll kill him setting this guy free and this guy can after I move this guy they can walk past each other it appears so after I shoot him into him he'll have one health left and then he'll be heavily damaged though kind of a problem since this is the first round and then so I'll push him into him he'll be take a damage and after he took a damage I could push him here here shoot right here knock him into this and then ha after Very codependent on where I decide to move this man. So that dude's just gonna straight up be gone, so. I could probably actually end up moving him right here. No, that will block one, but it won't take damage. Well, I know what I'm gonna do for the first part, so I'll do this. He's dead. I wish I could swap pace places, but I can't do that. shoot right here, but that's really hard to do. Gosh. Wait a minute, there's no need for me to even punch this man. He's not even attacking anyone. Step around this man. It doesn't matter, he's attacking something stupid. So he's stuck here, so I'm gonna end up shooting him in here. Yeah, I'm gonna end up shooting him into the forest. And then, um. Probably gonna end up pushing. way smarter. Push him 
closer. Ah, oh, gosh. Mm, building's gonna take a hit no matter what I do. Okay, how do I maximize this? I could honestly just sidestep that. Sidestep here. Seems like the best option. Um. So, how to deal with this? How to deal with idiots? Okay, I'll probably end up punching this man with this man this way, so we'll knock him that way, killing him, but it, it'll kill him. Then I'll step back here, and then just, like, knock him back there. That makes no sense. Dead. Then... Oh, I wish I could sidestep here. No, I can't. Um... Who's illiterate? Whatever, it kills him next turn. Thank you, game, for telling me that. I completely forgot. Wait, hold on. If jets can just airstrike them, why aren't we just using jets? Wait a minute, why do we need giant robots if jets do the job and jets are probably cheaper? Well, I don't know. Well, that was... We got through half the island today, guys. That seems like a good, decent amount of progress. So, I'm probably going to stop the video here. I'm not sure how long it's been exactly. I think 20 to 30 minutes, if my math is right. Maybe 15, maybe 20. Uh, depending on how long this first island took, I didn't really start counting from there. But we can, in the next episode, we'll be able to buy some things and we'll upgrade it our power grid by one. Next episode, I'll probably go for this, but I will see you guys later and I hope you have a good day or night.